Good morning. Happy Thursday. It is August 29th and I'm here with your positivity. Um, we are going to be focusing on a single card pull for, for today. Um, but I did want to start out with just a little bit of OM, right? Let's just focus on those things that bring us joy. Let's be happy. Let's be positive. Let's not let things that are going on in the world. I know things are a bummer, right? I know that. I know there's a lot of crap going on that we're unhappy with. I mean, just open up news, any news, I almost said the G word, but just open up the news channel and listen to my kitty cat cry. <laughs> I promise you she is fine. Um, but there's a lot of crap going on in the world. You have to look at it as what's in your circle of control, right? We can't control what goes on at cemeteries, right? We can't control that people roll up in there and use them as campaign headquarters. You know, we can't control what Monsanto is doing to our food. We can't control those things. It's all outside of our control. We have to focus on what we can control. You can only control two things, two things, what you say and what you do. That's the only thing within your control. So take a moment, step back, grab your tea, Inhale, exhale, right? Focus on those things you can control. I'm gonna focus on your reading, Rubios. Your reading today is coming from the River Witch Oracle. I think we're gonna continue this card until the new deck comes in. Um, I've got some new cards on order for the Crossroads Oracle. Um, I've expanded that deck. Um, that deck will be available soon. I've been notified that the checks in the mail, no, the cards are in the mail and I should have those soon. Um, so as soon as I get those, uh, you'll see those introduced into our daily readings. Let's pull a card from the River Witch Oracle. So our card today is winter. Let me hold that up for you. Okay. The three words for winter are introspection, rest, and conservation. So when we're looking at this card and we're thinking about the energy of this card, we really want to pay attention to how we feel inside, okay? What you're looking at with this card is reservation, right? You're looking at conservation. You're looking at pulling back from those places. If you've got your energy strong all about, you know, you've got a spell here and you've got, you know, positive energy over there. You need to pull all that back, right? It's time to pull it back. If you are focusing on, you know, several things that are happening, you've got events coming up, you've got, not today, right? Not today. Take some time for yourself today. Find a way to conserve that energy. Take a walk in a state park. Um, if, if, uh, take go outside and inhale. If you can't go outside, find your favorite incense, right? Find your, I've got some Indian temple incense down here that I use. Um, find some incense that you like. Create a space for yourself. This is your space. If your space is somewhere that you sit and read, go there. If your space is a gym, right? And you're more centered when you're working out, go do that, right? Find that space where you can conserve, you can rest, you can, you can, you can come back to where you are and, and look at how you are inside, right? You cannot pour from an empty cup. You can't, right? In order for you to continue to feed and nourish those around you, you must nourish yourself. So I'm challenging you today to, to find that place that place that makes you happy, that place that brings you joy, go there. Go there and just for five minutes. Bring in that energy. Bring in those things that, that bring you to a point of where you can look into yourself and say, self, this is your day, okay? That's our card for today. Got a little, got a little passionate on that. Um, so here it is for you again. It is the winter card. Um, again, those words are introspective, rest, and conservation. 
Um, take some time for yourself today. Uh, it's it's almost the end of the week, right? And I know there's folks that work on the weekend and you're like, lady, look, I've still got tons to do. Stop. Take some time for yourself today. You've earned it. Um, that's your reading for today. I hope you've enjoyed that. If you have comments, please feel free to leave it. I'm always welcoming uh, messages if you want to contact me directly. Um, gentle reminder, the vlog post for tomorrow. Yes, for tomorrow, I'm going to be focusing on the Covenant of Hecate's five virtues. Um, we'll be looking at compassion. Um, so I hope you'll join me for that. Remember to hit that subscribe bell so you get a notification and you won't miss that vlog post coming up. Have a glorious day today and I'll talk to you soon.